Hey guys, welcome back to your Objective C tutorials. And today we're going to be going over your basic arithmetic standard operators. And yeah, I mean, it seems a little bit basic, but I wanted to accentuate a few points in here, so bear with me as we run through some of these examples. Um, in your Objective C, we've got five primary, you know, standard operators um, for performing your arithmetic and. Uh, basically finding the remainder as well which that's gonna be the weird one that you'll have to kinda of tone into um, and that's called the modulus the rest are gonna be your basic you know add plus sign for addition minus sign for subtraction multiplication with the star and division with the forward slash so as you can see those the modulus will probably go into uh, another tutorial just focusing on that because it is a little bit odd and uh, kind of go through the significance of the modulus and we you know even why it's there so let's just jump into an example run through all of the uh, standard operators so you guys can see exactly how it works so the first thing that we're gonna do is establish a few variables for ourselves just to uh, point out the facts so we're gonna put a few integers in there and we're just gonna go uh, x equals 6 integer y equals oops, equals 5 and then we're gonna go integer z which will be where we store some of the, our equations here coming up give ourselves a little bit of room so the first one we're gonna just gonna do standard um, addition and with this we're just gonna go x plus y and let me give ourselves a little bit of space and in this case is gonna equal 11 so all we're taking is x is 6 plus y of 5 gives our z value 11. So the next one that we're going to go through is subtraction. And so we're going to go z equals x minus y. And in this case, it's going to equal 1. So basically we're taking 6 minus 5 equals 1. Next one we're going to do is z equals x or no, let's uh, let's reverse it here. Y minus X. So in this case, we're going to be taking five minus six, which is going to give us a negative one, which is still an integer, so it'll still be uh, printed out as an integer. Again, remember those are going to be your whole negative and positive numbers. So keep that in mind. All right, moving forward. Z equals uh, what are we up to? Multiplication. So X times y which 5 times 6 e gives us 30 and then z equals x divided by y now in this case we're taking 6 divided by 5 which should be 1.2 if I did that right which should be 1.2 however since we've used the integer up here we've used the integer variable type this is actually gonna equal 1 because as you guys remember with variables the integer is gonna be um, whole numbers so we're not gonna have any decimal values within there so that's what I want to do to kind of run through a finale of what you should do with division division you typically want to use a float value or float variable um, because in that case most division is going to be um, resulting with decimal places so in this case we probably would have wanted to uh, establish our variables as float equals five don't forget your semicolons and then again uh, float z so then in this case if we were to take this equation and uh, execute that our answer then would be 1.2 and then depending on what your float value is it could be uh, 1.2 you know with six decimal places or so so that's kind of the basics of the standard operators for your arithmetic um, like I said the modulus is kind of the the unknown you know what is that for what would you use it for and we're gonna do a kind of a basic tutorial on that for you know a short glimpse so you guys know where to use that, how to use it, and uh, moving forward. So hopefully that helps. Again, uh, subscribe to the channel. Drop us a comment on what you guys are having troubles with, and we'll try to help you out with that. 
All right, so peace out, guys.